Welcome to Devices Setup and today we will learn how to set up Ethernet backhaul in TP-Link Deco mesh system. Now this video guide works for all TP-Link Decos be it Deco X55, Deco S4, Deco X20, Deco M5, Deco X70 Pro, Deco X95 etc. So let's get started. First of all make sure you have already set up your TP-Link Deco if not then you can watch video given in the description to learn how to do it also you need to understand that ethernet backhaul provides way faster speeds than wireless backhaul so if you have set up your deco units and place them throughout your house and they all are talking to each other wirelessly then depending upon the distance between them and the number of walls in between them and also your internet speed then your upload and download speed will be very less when you compare the deco who are placed at the same location but are connected wired to each other so if you have ethernet cables installed in your walls or if you have ethernet cables running throughout your house then wired ethernet backhaul setup on your tp-link deco mesh system is one of the best option that can eliminate all the poor Wi-Fi zones in your house. So now let's see how to connect Ethernet cables to the decos. So first you will need to connect your main deco mesh unit with Ethernet cable to the modem. Also if the WAN port on the deco is not marked as internet or WAN then you can connect the Ethernet cable from the modem to any port on the deco and it will sense it automatically. Also if your modem is router come modem combo then make sure to turn off its router function you can watch video given in the description to learn how to do it next for making an ethernet backhaul on tp-link deco you can connect all three deco units to each other with ethernet cable while the main deco router unit is connected with ethernet cable to the modem and the router unit is connected with second unit via ethernet and then second unit is connected to third via ethernet now you can also connect any two if you don't want to connect them all at once like this can be done by just connecting main router unit to second unit leaving the third unit wirelessly or just connecting second unit to third unit via ethernet cable and leaving the main router unit wirelessly now it will all depend upon your home's layout and ethernet options convenient for you moreover when you have connected these decos via ethernet backhaul then you can use the remaining ethernet ports on these units for ethernet connections to your other devices like if you would like to connect your gaming console a printer a laptop etc to ethernet to these decos then you can use the remaining ports for these devices next you can also connect the second and third deco unit directly with ethernet cable to the main deco router unit so connect one end of the ethernet on the port of the main deco unit and another end of the ethernet on the ethernet port on the second deco unit next using another ethernet cable connect its one end on the main router deco unit and it's another end on the third deco unit lastly this is how you can use ethernet backhaul on your any mesh deco system and if you would like to know how to add unmanned ethernet switch with deco to increase the number of ethernet ports then you can watch video given in the description and a small request to all my viewers Please do support me by giving a like and subscribe if you found this video useful. I hope you have a blessed day. Thank you so much.